Rogers again slashes outside off stump. A bit uppish. And this time it goes to the boundary. They can't find their rhythm. Might hit a spot here though. It's short. And short takes it. Couple of bounces. Let's see what Sandu does. It's in that same area, that channel. And Rogers this time gets through. The nice cover drive. It'll run towards the boundary. Chases. Short on strike. It's outside off stump. Drives and a misfield. We'll get some runs for short and it'll get them four. So we've had a few go straight to the fielder. That one pierced. Keep those lines nice and tight. Short. That is launched. Long and high. Maximum. And the first six of the day here at Mackay. Matt Short with a pure connection. back and punch beautifully out through the covers. You can just see the timing there. Look at that. That has just raced along. Almost like lawn bowls just uh, racing along. Some of uh, the, the best first class players in the country. Oh, that is gigantic. That's a massive strike and that goes all the way for six. Almost. Oh, big appeal for caught behind and Rogers has to go. Almost a wicket out of nothing, but it's Gorinda Sandu that gets the important breakthrough. And Tom Rogers uh, disappointed to depart. Short. It's been working. Oh, that is right in the zone for short. Cross bat shot. It's been his best shot today. And he brings up the ton with another one. Matthew Short, in the form of his life, backs up a shield ton with a Marsh One Day Cup ton. What a hundred that was for Matthew Short. That ball's gone high. Running around his sand who should get underneath this one. And he takes it really well in the end. As he continues his good match, he got the opening wicket and he takes a very smart catch there. Running... Oh, he's gone for a bigger one here, Short. Another massive shot onto the onside Six. in back-to-back -back balls. Oh, this one's gigantic. Oh, take that. And he's gone for a big one there. He's got plenty of it. And I think he's got it just over the top of the man. Edge and taken from Pearson. So short innings eventually comes to an end. That Oh, he's cleaned him up. Hanscom going for the big shot over. Harper again across his crease. This time goes lofty over cover and point and gets six runs. The ramp is on. Successfully executed. And Sandu will not bring that one in so Merlo invents something a little bit different ramp over the keeper for four really smart batting from Harper stays in his crease this time does use that strength but he's caught at mid on Pearson put it down it does get Merlo on strike and he crushes that one Merlo on 48 back in his crease straight down the ground one bounce four 50 for Merlo and punishes the Queenslanders. Great innings by Merlo. Exactly what was required by the Vix. Moment. Advances and lifts it over mid off. Knows there's an area out there with no one. So it's a safe shot. And her first boundary of the Queensland innings. None for 11 so far this afternoon. That's in the half volley range. And Hazlitt says, yep, I'll take you to the boundary this season for Queensland oh, and that's edged and over the top of first slip first breakthrough for the Victorians oh and that is just class four from the moment it left the bat the run rate 6.98 a edge from Hazlitt and caught it first slip a great take to his right and O'Neill has the first for the Victorians oh, he just Renshaw again off his legs. Doesn't quite get the timing perfect, but it might just run away. This outfield is pretty lightning. Journey. And that'll... As we've said a couple of times, it'll be crucial today. Lifts it over cover. Easy as you like. Another boundary for Matt. Oh, a bit edgy. Over the top of point. 
Less convincing than that lofted cover drive, but the same result. Another. Renshaw tries something a little bit funky to end the 10th over and will get four for it. Oh, he's blazed at that one. That's gone a long, long way. That's a magnificent shot. Oh, that slammed down the ground. That is a powerful shot. That's just brute strength for Renshaw. Advancing and crunching that one down the ground. He gets all of that. He just chose not to play him. Oh, and this is going to be more runs. Wonderful hitting here from Matt Renshaw. Hammers that one down the ground. And that's a good 50 for Ben McDermott. He's 13th in list A cricket. And he is laying the foundation along with Matt Renshaw, the backbone for maybe an impressive run chase here this afternoon for the Bulls. Murphy. Always economical. He's back and powering this out through the covers. He's timed it beautifully. And what a way to bring up another 50 for Matt Renshaw. He's 14th in list A cricket. Sure was not even in the frame. Oh, that is clean, crisp, and brute strength from McDermott. Match chasing 350. Oh, lifts that one over third man. There's someone down there. Going to take oh. a no, it falls short. And the Mackay crowd are happy. Miss Renshaw. Oh, whips that off his leg. Six, easy as you like. Going to get another over out of Boland. Advancing down the wicket, McDermott just goes large again. Oh, he's got him. Switched the hit up, off stump, and a wicket for Todd Murphy and a much needed breakthrough for the Victorians. And there it is. Two tons in one week for Matt Renshaw against Victoria. A classy player fighting for a spot in the Australian team and puts another stamp down. Matt Renshaw, 100 for the Queensland Bulls. He's back. Renshaw wants a piece of Murphy and can't get enough of it. That man who's been taunted by the uh, riders on the boundary gets the catch. Perry takes one on the boundary and Murphy has two wickets in two overs any width or anything to get his arms free but always oh, been able to get his arms free through that has he got enough on it here's sam elliott oh that's been skied high into the air right up into the clouds harper underneath it he takes it what a big wicket and a big moment in the match he struggled at times sam elliott but show... elliott edged oh nice catch and slip two wickets and two balls three in the space of about eight or nine deliveries. And Sam Elliott gets Jack Wildermuth first ball and he is putting a big handprint on this game. Too much credit. Here's the hat-trick ball. Elliott into Sandu. Clipped off the toes. Expertly played by Sandu. He might in fact get four for it, he will. Pretty nicely done. First ball up, sliding into the pads. A, a marble in his hand. <laughs> Sandu again clears that front leg. Edge dropped, caught. Wow! Hanscom has picked up the crumbs from Harper and taken a gem at first slip. Guthrie again just tries to spank it. Skies it, point underneath it. Drops at the last minute. There's been a couple of them today. Misjudged. Sutherland comes into bowl. Guthrie again swings the shoulders. And gets six. Hey, sun in his eyes, though. Guthrie goes again to that man at deep backward square. As Boland approaches. Bryant goes towards that mid-wicket region. There's a man out there. Takes a specky. Throws it back in. It was Will Sutherland, who didn't have someone to throw it to, but saved six runs. What can Bryant do? Switch it, ramp over, fine leg. He's running back for it, and that is the game. Murphy takes the catch. The ball comes over his back, and Bryant's valiant efforts have been for nothing. Queensland fall 20 runs short, and Victoria register their third win of the Marsh One Day Cup season.